Fake meteorologist Chris Schultz here with your weekend fun forecast for January 27th through the 29th. Sponsored by Field of Greens, downtown's healthy lunch every business day. Happy Kansas Day weekend! It begins our 156th year of statehood. Friday at 11 a.m., the Capitol's first floor rotunda has ceremonies, KU chamber singers, and birthday cake. The Kansas Museum of History has free admission Friday from 9 to 3 with a bunch of hands-on activities for kids, historic craft demos, and performances by the Topeka High Drumline. If you can't make it, kshs.org has downloadable activities. The Topeka Library has a Kansas story time for ages 3 to 5 in their story zone, Saturday at 10. Finally, the Kansas Children's Discovery Center has a Kansas symbol matching game and a way to make your own, Sunday from 1 to 5. Just think, 156 years ago, Kansas was all open fields. Now it's only 96% open fields. We won't be all urban until the year 4000. Death Cafe is a free group discussion about facing death and making the most of life, held at Midland Care at 6th and Buchanan. It's Friday from 4 to 5, and it's an important subject, too rarely broached. So I almost feel bad that I saw Death Cafe and just assumed the classic bean was going through a goth phase. Topeka Blues Society kicks off the International Blues Challenge this Friday and Saturday at 8 p.m. Uncle Bose will host performers Dan Bliss, the Frank Ace Band, and many others. It's the World Cup of Blues Music, and you have ringside seats. Yeah, that sounds right. Saturday night, the Celtic Fox has a belated New Year's show with the Cover Girls and Cute Boys. So grab your dancing shoes and get ready to party like it's not quite 17. But wait, there's more. The Topeka Library's very popular trivia contest Friday night and Saturday afternoon. Flaming Idiots at Topeka Civic Theater and The Other Place at Helen Hawker. Live music and karaoke at all your favorite night spots. And you can see all of that stuff and more at everythingtopeka.com on the community calendar. I'm Chris Schultz and you keep celebrating Kansas.